Welcome to Kermit Uncut. Over the years, I've spoken to a lot of filmmakers and I often ask them which is the favourite of their films. And a regular response is that they'll say, it's the one that got away. It's the one that wasn't a hit. It was the one that was overlooked. I've spoken to a lot of directors, David Cronenberg. I think David Lynch has said the same thing, that if you make a film and it doesn't find its place in the world, you somehow feel more protective, more proud of it than if it's a huge hit. So, for example, in the case of David Lynch for ages, it was Twin Peaks' Fire Walk With Me. This is relevant at the moment because Lynn Ramsey's most recent film, You Were Never Really Here, has just come out on DVD. It got brilliant reviews, not least from me. It's an award-winning movie. It's extraordinary, fantastic central performance by Joaquin Phoenix, brilliant score by Johnny Greenwood, and reviews that really praised it to the heavens. And when people talked about Lynn Ramsey, they said from the director of Ratcatcher, which was an extraordinary feature, really great calling card coming of age film, and we need to talk about Kevin, which is this brilliant adaptation of a very dark book, which takes a very difficult subject matter and brings it to life vividly. The title that doesn't get mentioned is Morvan Callum, the feature that Lynn Ramsey made starring Samantha Morton and based on the book by Alan Warner. Now, you may well not have seen it because many people haven't. The story is Samantha Morton plays a young woman whose partner dies, leaving behind a manuscript that she then passes off as her own. And it's a story about identity, and it's a story about making your own personality and your own reputation in the world, and a million other things. And it has a brilliant soundtrack. It's beautifully filmed. It's really exciting and visceral and sometimes terrifying and sometimes beautiful. And it has the most wonderful central performance by Samantha Morton. Now, I am a huge fan of Samantha Morton. I think she can basically do no wrong. But in More Than Colour, for me, she is absolutely at the top of her game. She carries that film. That film is absolutely resting on her shoulders all the way through. And she's such a mesmerising screen presence. I remember seeing Morvan Callum when it first came out, and there was talk of it being this year's train spotting, you know, the new train spotting. It was one of those movies, it was, it was going to catch fire, it was going to catch everybody's attention. And then somehow it never happened. It never found that audience. It never got the release it should have done. And now when we talk about Lynn Ramsey and her great triumphs, as I said, people talk about Ratcatcher, people talk about we need to talk about Kevin, which are great films, but no one mentions more than Callas. So if you get the DVD of You Were Never Really Here, and if you're a Lynn Ramsey fan, check out more than Callas, because for me, it's the one that got away. And actually, that makes it all the more precious. There will come a period when the smart answer to the question, what's your favourite Lynn Ramsey film, will be more than Callas. Why not be ahead of the pack? This is dedicated to the one I love. Can never be exactly.